Okay, SOP, I'm saying this, standard operating procedure. And there are a set of rules that is given to you at the location to help you to do your work. And it differs from location to location or from post to post. If you are able to answer this, why, what, where, your, your, your report will flow. So, as a guard, especially when you are writing the DOB, if there is an occurrence, you should be able to answer all these five W's to make your report complete. Assuming I came to the office and ordered you to do something. So if you are writing it in the occurrence book, it will be like, at so so and so time on this day, WO2 reported to the office and asked me to send a letter to the And take note, if you are directing or you are making a car to park, don't stand directly behind the car or directly in front of the car. Stand at the side that the one you are directing, the driver will see you inside his driving mirror. Now security, you must take note of all vulnerable points at your post. Your job is to direct the car. I did not employ you, even our own drivers that are not allowed. The only person here who can drive a customer's car is this man. A loan policy. If you are a national service personnel, you are an intern, at this point, close your eyes because you don't qualify for a loan. Uh, you're supposed to be have worked for at least six months before you qualify for a loan at Silver Star Tower. And um, depending on your salary range, we work something out for you. There's always evaluation at the end of the year, okay? Depending on how well you do or how bad you do. If you are given written warnings, verbal warnings, this will definitely affect your evaluation. At the end of the year, if you do very well, you get a plus one, meaning you move to the next grade. Okay, your salary increases. Every year, we do this for our staff. 